Hey guys, this is Mike from B Tech Reviews here, and today we're just going to do a quick data speed test on the Moto G7. Now, the, this is actually the international version for me, so this is actually only GSM only, so no CDMA. Uh, for those of you who are wondering, again, I bought the white, uh, basically global version of this device. It's a little cheaper than the uh, the regular version. Uh, which right now is retailing at $299, but I believe the global version is retailing around between $150 and $170. Uh, so again, I'm just going to do a quick uh, little data speed test. Let's go ahead and open up uh, speed test. And I am on uh, Mint Mobile's network, which is uh, T-Mobile's network, basically. It piggybacks off T-Mobile. Uh, so if you're interested, <clears throat> I'm going to actually post a few links down below. I'm going to post the the link to this specific phone which is uh, the Moto G7 International and then I'm going to post the link to Mint Mobile because uh, you could actually get some uh, cheap uh, data plans for uh, very uh, inexpensive prices so again guys let me go ahead and run the speed test here and then we'll go ahead and get this going I'm going to probably run uh, two or three here so let's see again and weather outside right now is pretty ag ugly so let's see if we even uh, get some good data speeds here again uh, it is this is mint mobile uh, i have seen speeds as high as i believe 60 meg download speed uh, if i'm not correct and again this is going to uh, differ in all of the uh you know different locations that you guys are in uh, so obviously where you live is going to uh, play a big factor uh, but for here i'm getting about 26.8 download and right now averaging about 13 uh, megabits upload speed so so let's go ahead and just run another test here. Let's try that again. Let's see if we get any uh, different results. And try that one more time. There you go. So see now you see that it's kind of blazing a little bit faster. We're at almost uh, 45, which no one's going to complain about. I mean, I, I don't think I've ever had issues as far as data speeds go with T-Mobile or Mint Mobile. So. So again, I'm going to leave a referral code down below so that you guys can check that out. If you guys uh, decide to go with Mint Mobile, obviously uh, I'm going to get a little bit kickback from that or at least a little bit of credit, so not too bad. So again, right here, again, that was 43.6 megabits download speed and 14.5 upload, which again, I can't complain about the upload. Let's go ahead and do one more test uh, for you guys, and then we'll go ahead and finish off the video here. So it's rocking a pretty good average of, I want to say, you know, 35 and up basically, minus the first uh, test that we ran. Uh, so uh, again, I'm just going to uh, post this up really quick and hopefully uh, you guys like this video. If you guys do like, like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to me if you guys haven't, by the way. Uh, definitely, I'm going to be reviewing this phone over the next couple of days, so keep an eye out on those videos, guys. And again, uh, if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Again, this is 35 download and 21 up or 24 upload on that. So the upload speed actually went up on there. But again, guys, uh, this is Mike from B Tech signing off. We'll see you guys next time.